Um, it definitely hurt. Um, it took a you know a couple weeks to kind of heal that, but um, I guess you can't really dwell on losses. You got to move on. So we're taking what we can from it, use it as motivation this year. Left a really bad taste in my mouth and all of our mouths. It was just hard to overcome that. It's coming so close to being a section championship and moving on to the state tournament. It was just hard to it's we have to read back, bounce back though from that though. I don't know, one play either way in that game could change anything. And I think it definitely gives us a lot of motivation for this year to get back exactly where we were last year and, and win it this year. We were just etching to get out on the field again to get in the same position we were last year at that section championship game and turn around and win it this time. It was hard, that was a really close game because we were there the whole time. A couple mistakes here and there, we ourselves gave the game. It's not like they over beat us over. It was like we, we just gave it up ourselves, I guess. We were able to put two back-to-back uh, -back conference championship years together, and we were able to really turn the program around. And now that, now that we're on the top, we're looking to stay up there and repeat the success and build a real solid program for years to come. We're dangerous. We got some... We got some guys that can make plays, so it'll be exciting. Elliot, I mean, he's one heck of a running back, and you know, it, ma it makes it easy to block for him. Well, actually, it's it's gonna be pretty easy for me handing off the ball to guys like Will Bale and Elliot Cox. That makes it pretty easy. Um, of course, we lost some good receivers last year with uh, Jake Grievenau, Coleman Sweeney, and uh, Christian Custer. But we have some weapons this year with Matt Glassnap, Derek Bramer, um, Eli Custer, um, Jesse Oliver, guys like that. So we have guys that can step in and make plays. We gotta stay, stay physical. Our lines gotta keep moving. We're probably gonna be outsized a lot, so it's gonna be, we're gonna um, depend pretty heavily on the line to get things going because that's where it all starts. We lost uh, four out of the five starters from last year, so we don't have to rebuild this year. And then um, the roster's smaller too than we were last year. A lot of guys there have to step up and play big positions. Small, small guy playing a big position. Well, last year we kind of lived on big plays. We had a lot of big, big play threats, and although we do have that this year, I think it's a uh, be more of a grinded out kind of season. I mean, more long possessions, more uh, take time off the clock, things like that. Defensively, we're very strong. We got a good core of linebackers, got some good DNs and D lines, so it'll be interesting. Uh, we'll be quick and fast. I think we'll be undersized, you know, playing against a lot of the bigger teams. But I think if we use our speed and our quickness, I think we could. You know, make up for the size with that. We're a small defense, undersized, but I think you know one thing we do well is everyone knows their responsibility and their job, and everyone does it and trusts in everyone else. And I, th I think if we just keep that trust, we'll be really successful on defense this year. We want to be positive turnover ratio every game this year. Just gonna have to stop, stop the ball, stop them moving the ball on the field. We just. We like to make the offense earn every play, just grind it all out. Um, you know, we're, we hope we, we kind of pride on the fact that we stop the run and make them make the ball get, make them throw the ball, and that's when uh, that's when he had a chance to turn it over. We've been doing good. I mean, it's hard because we don't have a lot of guys that have a lot of varsity experience. We lost a lot of guys from last year, so I think that's the biggest thing is just getting the experience, getting used to playing at the varsity level. But I think we'll, we'll catch on and we'll be all right. You know, everything's really clicking and starting to come together, and we have uh, two teams right now competing against each other, and uh, it's really competitive, and it seems like it's going well for both teams. Well, we want to be the top three in the set, or I mean, in the conference on defense and offense. And we want to get back to where we were last year in that section championship game and win it.